I picked up a few new things, so it's time for an end of summer haul. In today's video, I'm sharing some of the new pieces that I picked up. This is a collective haul. We haven't done a good old haul in a while, so I'm excited to share this with you guys because I used to do them all the time on my channel. But I did uh, pick up a few things and I wanna share them with you. Some things were sent, some things are PR, so you guys will see those as well. But I'm really happy with everything that I have and I want you guys to be able to get your hands on it if you want to. So I'll have links to everything in the description box along with size information. So let's get into the video. Welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new here. My name is Ashley Park. This is Park Avenue and I have tons of fashion content. So if that's what you love, you're in the right place. Make sure you check out my other videos and when you find something you love, be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell. I upload multiple times a week and I don't want you to miss a thing. Now, before we jump into the video, I want to say a huge, tremendous thank you to you all. We are at 70K subscribers. Thank you guys so much. I cannot begin to even tell you how much I appreciate you guys. It is beyond so many of you who are here from the beginning. You guys know all about my journey. If you are new, welcome to the channel. I want you to check out some of my other videos, some of my life update videos so you guys can get to know me more. And of course, follow along because there'll be more fashion videos and vlogs and you guys will get to know more about me. But I'm so happy to have you here. So many of you have really been so like encouraging and you guys leave the best comments and you really are enjoying my content and you're finding value in it. So I want to say a huge thank you to you all for subscribing and just being here and tuning into all of my videos videos. We made it to 70k and I'm just excited to continue sharing with you guys and bringing you along on my journey. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. And I also want to give a very special shout out to Yvonne Bonner. Thank you so much. Yvonne gave me my very first Super Thanks. I appreciate it so much. Now, if you guys are not familiar with a Super Thanks or you're just not sure, maybe you never heard of it, at the bottom of my video or underneath my video, it's a little heart-shaped icon with a dollar sign and you can donate to your favorite YouTuber if you like. There are many ways for you to support your favorite creators and YouTubers and you can just subscribe, you can share the videos, you can do everything, give the videos a thumbs up and now you can also uh, donate to their channel. Any amount is always appreciated. Thank you so much and I just really appreciate you guys. You guys have really shown tremendous support, great comments, you guys always tune in to every video and you guys love Loved my last video and I really appreciate that. I really want to get into full content. I'm really excited and I'm glad to see so many of you are excited as well. But I also noticed that a lot of you are not ready to let go, but that's okay, I understand. I mean, we do have a lot of summer left. Well, not that much, but we have some good, we have a good amount of summer left. So I understand that you might wanna, you know, enjoy it while you can, but we gotta get prepared as well. We gotta get prepared for the fall. And there are so many exciting trends going on and just a lot of ways to really have fun with fashion. So I'm looking forward to it. And I've already started incorporating that. So if you haven't seen it already, then tune in to my last video. It's my 2022 fall trends. I just picked out a few fall trends that I really like and am wanting to incorporate more of into my wardrobe. I'm actually going to show you a piece that I have now that is also really on trend right now, but so cute and so like such my vibe, but I'm really excited about it. And before I show you the actual pieces that I want to talk about, I want to talk about my jewelry. Now I get a lot of questions about this necklace and my bracelet. Now these are pieces that I got from TJ Maxx months ago, like months and months ago. And when they were in stock, I was able to link to them on the website, but they're out of stock now. You guys bought them all up. <laughs> and some of you told me that you were able to find them in store, but I did find a couple of similar pieces that is a set as well. Um, so I'll link to that. And if I can find any others, whenever I do find them, I'll leave them in the description box. So check the description box for these. And then I also have been getting more questions about my earrings. These earrings are Valentino and they were pretty pricey. They're about $400, but I found a very similar pair from Walmart actually. So I'll link to those if maybe you don't wanna splurge on these, but you really like you know, the whole aesthetic or whatever. I'll link in the description box so you can try them out and let me know what you think about them. All right, so let's get into the pieces that I picked up. So if you follow me on Instagram, I shared with you guys that I was looking for a pair of black, um, like plastic frame sunglasses. I wear a lot of wire frames. They're really, really oversized and they look very similar. I have a specific style that I usually go for. So I tend to just always have, you know, always acquire sunglasses like that. But I really wanted a pair of just like black frame sunglasses. And so I saw these Versace ones on the Nordstrom anniversary sale. And I did post about them when I saw them. So hopefully you guys picked them up as well if you were interested, but I really love them. So 
They're just a pair of black frame sunglasses. They have a brown lens, which I really like because I tend to go for um, like lighter color sunglasses or actual color sunglasses. I didn't have any black frame sunglasses, which is why I wanted these, but I like that they have a nice dark brown uh, sunglass lens. So that's really cool. The Versace symbol here on the side and the arms are nice and wide. They're not like too chunky or anything, but I really like them. And they're actually slightly smaller than I would usually go for. I tend to go for really large and these are actually a really good size. I'm really happy with these and I, I just really love them. I saw that they also come in maybe like a tortoise. I think that's what I saw when I looked on another website as well. So I'll link to these for you guys and then I'll link to some others that are similar in case maybe you're looking for something a little bit um, you know, of a lower price point, but I really love these. So I've been reaching for them over and over. I've been wearing them all the time and I have to kind of like tell myself to switch out and wear some of my other sunglasses, but I really love these. So if you head to my Instagram, you'll see me wearing these in a few, a few, uh, pieces of content that I posted. So I really love these. Next up, these are my favorite shoes at the moment. I've actually only gotten a chance to wear them one time. And I did show you guys that I picked these up on Instagram and I think I shared them in a video already. But I wanted to report back and let you guys know that I absolutely love these. They're very comfortable. I did wear them for like, they, it was like four hours I had these on and I wasn't standing around or anything like that. But I feel like that's a good amount of time to know if your feet are going to be hurting. And these are very comfortable. I really like these. I love that the heel is nice and sleek. I talked all about how I just love like the way this shoe is constructed. I talked about that in a previous video. Actually, it's the 2022 uh, Fall Trends video. So make sure you guys check out that video. It's a good one. But I really love these. And I would love to have these in a closed toe version. I would love to have these in gold and silver. I would love to have a few pairs of these. And I really, really hope that he does. This is still Whitesman, by the way, if I didn't mention it already. I would love to have these in a closed toe version just because I think they're just really good. They're just so good. And even when I don't reach for them as much anymore, I think they're going to be right back around and I'm going to reach for them again. You know what I mean? Like, I, I feel like this is going to be something I always have in my shoe wardrobe that I'm going to reach for. Like, this is not going to go anywhere. Like, I really love these. <laughs> they're so cute. I really love these a lot. So very comfortable, really cute. These are high, though. They're very high. But of course, you know, that platform gives you that comfort. So the next couple pieces I wanna show you are from the brand Vince. I really like that brand. It's very like minimalist, but really like cool, really like well-made pieces. The pieces are really cool. Vince is a really cool brand. I've had shoes from the brand before um, and I don't have that many clothing pieces. I have a couple of dresses, but I really am happy with these other two pieces that I wanna show you now. So summer is not completely over, but I am gonna be wearing these into the fall. These are a pair of shorts and they're actually a linen blend, but the weight of them and the material, like the way they feel, is gonna look really cute with a pair of boots as well. Once it gets like a little bit chilly outside and maybe like a trench coat or a leather jacket or something over my shoulders, that's gonna be really cute. But what I love about these, this style of short is just really complimentary to women, period, but especially curvy girls, because I find it difficult, obviously. I'm sure a lot of you can relate. Um, my hip to waist ratio is pretty different. So I struggle with finding things that are spacious enough to fit over my hips, but come in enough that I don't have to get the waist taken in. And I really like these. Now, if I'm honest, they're just slightly tight across my hips, but when I did size up, they were a little bit bigger than I wanted. So I just got this size and it looks really good. And like I said, this is a linen blend, so it's gonna relax a little bit. I love the fact that these shorts have the seam going down the front, very flattering for that elongation. I love that. And then I love that it has the darts in the back. It's almost like it was already taken in to fit really well at the waist. And then it has a zip going down the side which is really nice and the pockets the pockets are really good they don't pucker um, if they were like slash pockets when you have big hips and then you get like a slash pocket it puckers and then it adds that volume but these lay pretty flat so I really love these shorts next up I picked up this cardigan from Vince I love this I love the material it's very slinky like it snaps back kind of it feels really really nice it has a nice weight to it what I love is how it feels as well. I love anything ribbed, I always tell you guys that, but I love the way this feels. The material is just really nice and it's very cool against the skin. And this is something that I still can wear into the fall, but it's actually really perfect for right now as well, because even though it is a longer sleeve, it is it is a sweater, I can wear this, you know, inside, in and out of air conditioning, and I'll still be really comfortable in this. And it kind of like almost like melts, you know what I mean? Like holding it up, it kind of doesn't have any shape or anything. So you guys will see once I try it on, but I really love the color. It looks so good on camera. It really pops. It's like a tomato red, really nice and vibrant. I love it. And then the buttons are actually 
iridescent almost. They have like a, a seashell sort of iridescence. They're black, but it really has a nice sheen to them. So cute. I mean, they're not exactly black, but like they're dark, but they have like a, a seashell kind of iridescence. Really beautiful. I love this so much. So I'm excited to style this up. I have an outfit, like a couple outfits in mind to wear this, but I'm just going to try on everything for you guys so you can see how it looks. So if you want to grab it, you can, because a lot of these pieces, they go so, so quickly. Whenever I show you guys things, they go so quickly. So I'm definitely going to be styling them more because you guys know I wear my pieces over and over again. So you will see them, but if you want to grab them, I'll go ahead and grab them now if I were you. Next up, a few pair of joggers from Loft. Now these are more for comfort, relax, chill vibes. And my life is pretty like casual, like my day to day when I'm running errands or I'm just, you know, chill if I'm not going anywhere special. I still want to be cute, but I want to be very comfortable. And these are really nice. The material's great. They have a nice like wide band um, at the ankle. They are like slightly cropped, but if you're shorter than me, I'm, I'm about five, six. If you're shorter than me, then they're going to be probably full length on you. I love the waistband. They just feel really good. And so this color, which is more like a slate, it has like a little bit of a blue to it. And then an olive, of course, this is a really gorgeous color, this olive color. And then of course a black. So I will link to all of these for you guys in case you're looking for some really great casual pieces. And I find that I don't have enough like throw on and go kind of clothes. And that's what I'm looking more for. Like lounge, kind of like, you know, athleisure type vibe when I'm not going anywhere, but I still want to be put together, but I don't want to wear jeans, you know? Um, so these are really great options. Next up, I picked up a couple of pair of jeans from Express. So I actually haven't really tried Express jeans before. So I was like, let me try them out now. I need some jeans. I'm looking around and I saw that they had a couple of pair of like flared kind of jeans. And I really have not had any look with jeans lately. Everything is cropped. Uh, everything is just not what I'm looking for. I really want either a pair of full length straight leg jeans. I love a flare, I love a wide leg, anything like that, but everything seems to be cropped. So I was struggling to find a pair of jeans that I love. Um, you guys know I have been wearing my Abercrombie um, Curve Love jeans. I love those, but I also wanted another option. So I was in Express and I was like, let me try these out. So I tried these and I haven't had a pair of dark wash jeans for forever. I have not had them in a really long time and I really like these. I also wanted them in long, but when I went to the website to see if they had long, they were sold out. So hopefully they bring them back because with the longer ones, I find that they just look better when I wear heels, especially now with the platforms. I just really want a nice long pair of jeans. So we'll see, hopefully they do come back in stock, but these are really great. Now I got these in a size 12 and we're gonna talk about sizing in a second, but I do really like these jeans. They have some really good stretch really good stretch and i just love the wash i love the stitching on them they're just a nice pair of like classic like 70s vibe style jeans and these are in a 12 regular so since those dark wash jeans worked out i'm like let me try another pair and so i saw that they had these and these are super cute they have the seam running down the front very flattering that you know flare style i love it so I was like, let me try these. I love the wash of them. Now these don't have as much stretch, but I had to go up two sizes in these. They don't have much stretch at all, like almost none. So I went up two sizes in these to be able to get them on, but now I have to get the waist taken in because the waist is obviously two sizes too big. So that's the struggle. You guys already know. So I'm gonna have to take these to the tailor. I also wanted these in long, just you know for heels and everything like that, but they didn't have long in these either. So I'm gonna have to hope, you know, hope for a restock. And once they do, I'm gonna grab these. But let me know what are you guys like favorite jeans? I know everyone loves good American. I, you know, I showed you guys the Abercrombie jeans that I love. I'm gonna try a few pairs from Good American because I have had um, jeans from Good American in the past. So we'll see what's going on now. I'm gonna try some on, but I kind of like like chilled on my jean shopping because I was just like, I'm not. I, don't, I want a full length pair of jeans. Everything's cropped. So I'm gonna return to that because I'm gonna find you guys some really great jeans as well. I'm sure you guys have the same struggles I do. So. You know, the search continues, but I really like these. So I'm just going to get the waist taken in on um, the larger size. Next up, I want to show you guys some sports bras that I love. Now, these were sent to me from Waco. I was able to pick out the ones that I wanted, and I absolutely love these. I've shared with you guys some other pieces from Waco that I love, other bras that I wear all the time. So I will link to those as well, some of my favorites, my favorite strapless bra, my favorite t-shirt bra, all those things. And I have a playlist of all my like recommendations for undergarments because you guys ask me all the time about those shapewear bras, all that. I'll link to that playlist as well. And then I'll also 
link to the pieces that I really like as far as Waco pieces. And then I showed you guys my favorite sports bra from Yummy. I mean, I have a bunch of recommendations, so make sure you guys check the description box for all that information. But I really love these sports bras from Waco. I personally, when I'm being very active, I like a, like a firm control. I like that, and if you are busty, you might prefer that as well. I love these. Now, I got a couple with molded cups. And then I got a couple that don't have molded cups. They're more like traditional sports bra, you know, kind of shapeless, but they all have underwire. So they're definitely gonna all hold you in. But I really love these and I'll link to all of these for you guys. Next up, I got a package in from Aveda and I really like Aveda products. I mean, their hair care is really good. So I love when I get a package in from them and every everything is like a spa like vibe. So I just love their packaging, but their products are really good as well. So this one is Aveda Invanti Advanced Thicker Fuller Hair Begins with Scalp Care. So that was really nice because I have a dry scalp. I get really flaky and itchy when it's like close to the time that I need to wash my hair. Um, so this is gonna be really nice. I'm gonna try these out. But what I got in this package is an exfoliating shampoo, which is gonna be new for me. I've never tried an exfoliating shampoo. I've heard things about them before, but I've never really heard any like good or bad about them. So I'm excited to try that out. And I also got this intensive hair and scalp mask. It also came with this scalp revitalizer, which, which says it's a solution for thinning hair. So that's really nice. And then in this package, I also got one of those Scalp cleaners, which is really nice. Like you can give yourself a massage and stimulate your scalp, which is great for hair growth. I also got this candle, which smells really, really good. It's definitely giving a spa vibe, a spa, a spa feel. But it says vegan soy wax. I really like that. And you guys know, if you watch my channel for a while, that I really prefer like soy candles, coconut wax, things like that. Um, just because it's healthier to breathe in. It's not like toxic. And I just find that it doesn't like, it's not so like intoxicating like a headache, like in an uncomfortable way. Anyway, I prefer soy or coconut wax or anything like that. And then it also came with one of these um, stress fix rollables, which is great because you're supposed to rub them like um, you know, on your pulse points and then it kind of like gives you a calming, like soothing feeling. So I'm looking forward to trying this. It's a concentrate, stress relieving aroma, like aromatherapy. So this is gonna be really nice. I almost forgot to show you guys this one. This is something I picked up from Nordstrom Rack. I was Googling around looking for metallic pieces, some gold pieces. You guys know how I feel about gold, silver, everything. I want it all. And so I was just looking for some cool pieces for the fall and I came across this leather jacket. It's by a brand called Walter Baker. I've never heard of him before. I don't know anything about the brand. The jacket original price was about $700 and it was on sale for $200. So I was like, well, let me just try it. It had a lot of good reviews and I really love it. The leather is nice and soft. It feels really good. I do feel that it runs a little small, just like slightly because I got this in an extra large. And usually an extra large would be just like a little bit roomy on me, but it fits kind of perfect. So just know that. And this is the largest size that it comes in. If you were wanting something oversized, it's not gonna happen with this one, but it does fit really well. Really gorgeous jacket. And it has silver hardware, which is something I don't, I don't usually go for, you know, the mix, but I do want to add more silver pieces. So this is gonna be my way to bring it in a little bit. <laughs> I love this, I love the gold. And I. this is the kind of gold that's not gonna like flake or peel. You guys might know what I'm talking about, but there are some metallic pieces that you can just tell that's gonna flake or peel. Over time, of course, it's gonna show some wear, but it's going to be, like, I can tell that this is gonna wear nicely. I'm gonna be able to get, you know, some seasons out of this. I'm really happy with this, it feels so good. They do have other colors. If this metallic is not your speed, they had a red, I think they had a black and a brown as well. So I'll link to it and you guys can check it out, but I really love this. And so I thought it was a great deal, a really nice quality leather jacket, and I'm really happy with this. Stay tuned you guys for styling because I'm excited. Here's the last piece that I wanna show you guys. And this is a tuxedo style button up that I picked up from Banana Republic. And you guys know how much I love tuxedo style anything. I just think they're so beautiful and I love incorporating kind of like evening style pieces into my daytime wardrobe. And this is one of my favorites. Now I ordered this well over a week ago and for some reason it took a really long time to come to me, but I'm happy that I finally got it. It actually just came while I was sitting down recording this video. So I was like, let me just throw it in this video. I'm so happy with the way that it looks. Now I thought it was like a tool kind of a material, 
um, but it's not. It's a, a fabric called Raimi, I believe is what they call it on the website. Um, it's supposed to be really like, you know, comfortable and easy to wear and all that. So we'll see. Now, this actually was one of the last few that they had on the website. So I got a double XL because I usually wear a medium or a large in Banana Republic, but they didn't have that size. This was literally the last size that they had. So I'm like, let me just get it. The worst that could happen is that it's oversized and I'm into an oversized look. So that's fine with me. So I hope that this works out for how I want to style it, but it's really gorgeous. And it also comes in white. And they had, last time I checked, they had lots of sizes in the white. So if you want this top, I will go ahead and grab it. I mean, you can't go wrong with the classic white, but I really love this top. And I actually also might grab it in the white as well, you know, just cause you can't go wrong. But I love it. I think it's so beautiful. It's so beautiful and it's kind of sheer. So that's gonna be really cute whether I want to style it for evening or daytime. I think it's a really nice piece to have. So that's it, you guys. That's everything that I picked up recently. I felt like it was just gonna be a few things, but after I talked through everything, it felt like it was more than a few things. But <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed it. I have links to everything that I shared in the description box, along with size information and you know anything else that I didn't get to say in this video, I'll list it in the description box as well. And if you guys wanna check me out on some other platforms like Instagram, Pinterest, or TikTok, I'll have all that information listed in the description box. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Thank you guys so much for watching. And if you made it this far and you haven't subscribed, already what are you waiting for i would love to have you join the family subscribe and tune in to my future videos because i have lots of full content coming up and lots of styling i can't wait to share everything that i have in mind to share with you guys so stay tuned i'll catch you guys in the next video be sure to check out my ebook. You guys, I got such a positive response from so many of you, and I thank you guys so much. I'm so happy you guys loved uh, my ebook where I shared with you guys everything that I have done to get to the point that I'm at right now. I get so many questions about how to be successful on YouTube, what I did, you know, any tips that I have to offer, and literally everything is in that guide. And I got so much good feedback from you guys about how valuable you feel that this guide is and it truly is so now i'm really excited to say that you guys can get the audio version of this ebook i know a lot of you might be very busy but you still want to learn how to succeed on youtube you want some tips and some guidance and i know that a lot of people are just really busy maybe you're a mom maybe you are only able to listen while you're like on the computer at work so this audiobook is going to allow you to do that it's going to give you all the same information but now you can just listen and you don't have to sit in one place and read we're all very busy and I know we all are multitasking, but you still want to be able to get the information. So the audiobook is now live. You guys check the description box and pick it up. And I would love to know you guys' feedback. It helps so much in me just like, you know, being able to share more with you guys and just know that you're able to receive the information. So definitely check the description box. I'm really excited for this and I cannot wait for you guys to check it out as well. Oh.